Everyone is different and everyone is looking for the secret to weight loss. And what if it turned out to be eating cookies all day? A new diet promises you can do it with just that. But is it too good to be true? Consumer correspondent Elizabeth Leamy decided to take an in-depth look at this unlikely diet and hear what she found. At age 28 and 240 pounds, Josie Raper knew she had to make a change to live a healthier life. And it's not so easy for me. I would rather eat a cupcake um, than eat vegetables and go to the gym. After trying dozens of different pills and programs that didn't work, she found Dr. Siegel's cookie diet online. Six months later, her size 24 frame was a size 6. When I started uh, the cookie diet, there was no splurging. There was no um, sneaking little snacks. I was very strict. Josie's success story landed her on the cover of People magazine. Celebrities like Denise Richards, Jennifer Hudson, and Kelly Clarkson have also reportedly tried the cookie diet. Here's how it works. You eat six specially developed diet cookies throughout the day with water, not as set meals, but whenever you feel hungry. Then you eat an approximately 500 calorie dinner of lean protein and vegetables. Dr. Sanford Siegel developed his diet cookie after years of treating obesity patients. Siegel says the number one factor that wrecks diets is hunger, so he wanted to create a product that would control that hunger. Why cookies? It started with a formula of amino acids that I put together, uh, but then I needed a vehicle for it, and a cookie was the obvious vehicle. It, it was something people like, uh, ladies could carry it around in their purse. Uh, it doesn't require refrigeration. Siegel says the very low 1,000 calorie diet is designed to take weight off fast. I know for, for experience that if the weight loss doesn't come off fast, they give up the diet and therefore you don't accomplish anything. There's no credible medical evidence that the cookie diet actually helps people to lose and maintain weight loss over a long period of time or that there's any health benefit from doing this. Dr. Lewis Aroni is as what's missing from the cookie diet is good nutrition. I'm concerned that if someone were to follow this over the long term, there are many different nutrients that they would be missing that you would normally get by eating regular foods. GMA sent the cookies to a lab to see if they matched the nutrients listed on the label. And yes, the cookies are what they say they are, but experts say what they are is not enough. Some people say your diet does not give people enough calories for good health. What's your response? My response is that I have treated over a half million patients over a 34-year period with Dr. Siegel's cookie diet. I've yet to see the first case where anyone suffered any ill effect uh, from eating a low calorie diet. It just doesn't exist. In fact, Siegel says obesity is much riskier than a very low calorie diet and that cookie diet customers take a daily multivitamin to assure good nutrition. He says he never intended for the cookie diet to be a long term program, but Josie, for one, has been on it for two years now and doesn't know if or when she'll stop. She's a size zero these days and no longer needs her fat pants. And the cookies are a hit. They are now in GNC stores, Walgreens, about $250 a month, $8 a day mm -hmm. for supply. And we tried them. What do you think? Well, <laughs> they're not like Oreos. I mean, they're not like <laughs> that kind of cookie. But, I think they're but they right. are hefty in some way. But it was interesting what he said, that the important thing is to get started and have results fast. Otherwise, you give it up. So if, if it's a starter approach, who knows? For some people, it seems to be working. All right. Thank you, Elizabeth Leamy. Find out more about this on ABCnews.com.